know the old adage, you have to look before you leap? Well, the same applies to driving. You need to see where you're going to get there safely. And on today's autofocus, I'm gonna show you how to properly adjust your side view and your rear view mirror. Yeah, seems simple enough. You adjust your mirrors till you can see behind you and everything's great. But there is a technique so you can see into those blind spots behind your car and see that car coming up behind you. Now the proper way to adjust your driver's side side view mirror is to lean your head all the way over until just about to touch the glass like this. Then adjust your mirror until you just see beyond your car. You should just see just that little sliver. You shouldn't see that. You're going to adjust just beyond that. And what that's going to allow you to do is to see past that blind spot. You don't need to see your car. You need to see the lane next to you and to see the car that's in it. Now with the passenger side side view mirror, you want to lean as far over towards the center as you can and adjust that mirror till you see just beyond your car. That will allow you to see into that three quarter view blind spot on your passenger side. Now for the rear view mirror, a lot simpler. Most people do this right. Obviously you just want to adjust it till you see right behind you. If you're in that Jeep right there and you want to be in this turn lane, what do you do? You check your side view mirror, you don't see a car there, and you pull on in. And then suddenly, boom, there's a car there. Now, if your mirror was adjusted properly, this is what you would have seen. Take a moment, adjust your mirrors properly. A well-adjusted mirror can actually save your life. I'm Ben Italis with this week's Autofocus.